What is up guys, welcome or welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Day, and on this channel I'll talk about cybersecurity, college, certifications, and internships. And this video is going to be a quick review of Security Blue Team's introduction to threat hunting course. Over the last couple of days, I've been going through the Blue Team Junior Analyst pathway, which consists of a threat hunting course, which I'm currently reviewing, digital forensics course, a network analysis course, an OSINT course, and a introduction to dark web operations course so this is the fourth course i'm completing out of six courses they offer in the blue team junior analyst pathway and if you haven't seen my review videos on the previous courses i'll leave cards to them on the screen as well as the playlist covering each of the courses in the pathway so now to the review the in introduction to threat hunting course was a really really interesting course and i had quite a good amount of fun completing it it did take me a bit longer than the previous courses, but it was definitely fun to complete. Um, it had a really, really nice challenge as well as nice challenges for each of the course section. So this course covered um, two major tools, which was the Mandiant, Mandiant IOCE and Mandiant Redline. So for Mandiant IOCE, you use this um, application to kind of create specific rules that you generate from uh, different uh, specifics of a malware sample that you provided with so maybe like the file name or the file hash maybe the md5 hash or the sha1, SHA -one hash and then based off of these um, strings or hashes or file names you ingest that into mendiant redline and use that to hunt for malware samples in you know a, a file or a user's computer whatever it is you're you're uh, you're using to hunt for malware so this was really really fun um to complete and then the course challenge kind of tied in all of the information you learned from uh, generating the indicators of compromise and also hunting for the files with Mendiant Redline into the final challenge, which, like I said before, was really, really fun to complete. Um, I recommend this course if you're trying to learn more about threat hunting. You're definitely going to get a good understanding and a good introduction to how the whole methodology works and, you know, some industry great tools that, uh, that threat hunters use. So definitely check this course out. If you are looking into get, get started with threat hunting and just kind of want to know what it's really about. So these were some tools that the course covered. So Mendiant, IOC Collector, MD5 Hashing, SHA-1 Hashing, Strings, File Properties, Mendiant Redline, Virtual Machine. I recommend that you use a Windows 10 virtual machine. Like you do not, you probably do not want to run the malware samples on your actual device. So definitely try to use a, a Windows 10 VM. I use the Windows 10 VM on VMware workstation and I isolated it and made sure to turn off all of the network adapters after downloading the malware samples in order to uh, properly analyze it and properly use the indicators of compromise from the malware samples to hunt for the malware files on the provided file that was used for the final challenge. So uh, definitely uh, look into using a, a VM so you, you know don't accidentally run a malware file on your host computer. So just like the other courses, it does come with a certificate of completion, which is not a certification, but is a certificate so you can share on LinkedIn to show that you have completed the course and you've developed skills in threat hunting. You can share it on your LinkedIn, add it, add it to your LinkedIn profile, and just kind of show that you have gone through the course on threat hunting and could be a nice thing to have. So thank you very much for watching this video. If you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe and be sure to share, share this video to anyone who you think it will provide value to. And I will see you in the next video.